chance to win back-to-back -back Euroleague titles happens rarely, if ever, for most players. Early in the 2013 championship game in London, the opportunity to repeat seemed anything but sure for the great Vasilis Banoulis. Real Madrid had led by 17 points before his teammates cut the difference to four. But at half-time, Spanoulis had zero points. What happened when he returned from the locker room, however, changed basketball history. The game is uh, 40 minutes, it's not 20 minutes. I thought that uh, the difference was not so big uh, in the half, so the other guys my teammates made a great job to, to be close on the game. So yeah, I felt that I have to do something to help the team, also from my side. Spanoulis did not wait. A minute into the second half, he struck from long range for his first three points of the game. He then scored from the arc on the next two possessions too, for three three-pointers in just 75 seconds. None of it, he remembers, was planned. Usually I'm not thinking what I will do, you know, I do in the game what uh, the defense is giving to me. You know, if, if I had to, to, show, to make good shots, uh, if they give me these good shots, I will take them. If I have to, to make some uh, creations for my teammates, I will make this, you know. I don't have something specific in my mind when I have the ball. You know, I try to do what my, the defense is giving me. Madrid rallied late in the third quarter to retake a brief lead, but early in the fourth, Spanulis was ready with another picture-perfect three-point shot. That set the stage for his fifth one, which was pure serendipity. It's obvious my confidence was uh, very high. I saw the clock that it was remaining uh, three, four seconds, three seconds more, and you know, I, d I didn't have other choice, just uh, to shoot with confidence. And, uh, you know, I was lucky and uh, the shot was successful. Olympiakos won 100 to 88 after having scored an incredible 63 points in the second half, while Madrid had 47 and Spanolis himself 22. He was then crowned Final Four MVP again as his team became just the second in two decades to repeat as Euroleague champion. This was a great game, great feelings. It's something that did not happen so often, you know to beat down 17 and to come back in the, in the final of Euroleague and to score uh, 100 points and to make such a game in a back-to-back -back title. Uh, this is something incredible and, you know, it's beautiful memories.